It was senior day at Soika Pavilion on Sunday, as Corey Starkey, Josh A. Singleton, and Stephen Casper were all recognized prior to the start of the Bison men's basketball game against Boston University. The Bison rode the senior day in motion and good play to a quick nine-point lead, but the Terriers had back-to-back three-pointers by Chetty Mosley and Cedric Hankerson to quickly cut the deficit to four. Bucknell pushed the lead to six on this Stephen Casper to DJ McClay feed. And the Bucknell lead would go a few points higher after a Ryan Frazier three-point opportunity. Frazier will get it. He'll penetrate down low. Got bumped. Lays it with the right hand off the glass. And ladies and gentlemen, he was fouled. Oh, my almighty. What a drive. What a stick. What a shot by the fray. Or the Rocket, if you're in Section D at Soika Pavilion. The Terriers fell behind the Bison as the first half wore on, thanks in large part to a barrage of three-pointers by Chris Haas. Starkey getting his first action in about two weeks. We'll give it to Haas. He's open, shoots a left-wing three. Bingo! Hankerson says, I can't stop the man. And the man is C.H. What's that stand for? Christopher Haas. That's what. And a coast to coast play by Ryan Frazier. Here's a Bucknell fast break. It's the fray. He'll stop. He'll shoot. He'll score. He'll score. He'll score. Time out. Boston University. The Bison led 38 to 28 at the break and would push their lead to 20 points on this nifty move by senior Stephen Casper. Just couldn't quite get it to fall. Here's Casper slithering in the lane with a left hand layup. And the friendly ghost has his first field goal. He has four. As expected, the Terriers wouldn't quit, and this three-pointer by Cedric Hankerson cut the deficit to only 12 points with plenty of time left. But Nana Fallon scored two straight times down the court. Bucknell needs a bucket this time. Here is Fallon against Olsen. Got bumped, goes with a skyhook with the right hand this time, and he got it up a good. There's Fallon right baseline. Back down on Alston. Go with a sweeping hook shot on the right baseline with the right hand. He'll get it in. He has 16 one away from tying his career high. And Dom Hoffman made one of the biggest plays of the game as the shot clock ran down shot on the bison. Clock, which now shows 12. Get out to Haas. Ask for a screen by Oberfeld. He'll comply. Haas 18 footer straight ahead is way short. Rebound. Hoffman for reverse layup. And Dominic has four with the shot clock at three. Bucknell would see its leading scorer, Chris Haas, pick up his ninth 20 point game of his junior season. 13 remaining. 22 to shoot. Bison by 12 with the ball. Led by as many as 21 this half. But Boston University has not given up. Haas again with an underhand scoop shot. This one he'll get the roll. Chris will get his 20th point. And although Boston University received an emphatic dunk by Eric Fanning, it wouldn't be enough as the Bison would win the game by a final score of 78-69. to 69.